In this video, I want to pay special attention to the structure there was, there were, and of course its forms, there wasn't, was there, were there, and so on. The situations you use there is or there are, are the same in which you are going to use there was or there were. So you say there is a cup on the table, there are children in the zoo. There is, when you describe one thing, when you speak about one thing, there are when the people or the things are more than two. Two or more than, than two, actually. Okay, so the positive and negative questions on the way they are formed for the there is structure are clear. What about there was and there were? Well, they are identical. Just please be careful because a lot of people find it difficult uh, when they want to say something in the past or when they want to, to, to change one structure into another, they start thinking, what do I need to use? Well, you need there was or there were. And the logic is the same. So there was, there wasn't, was there. When you speak about one thing. Two or more things. There were, there weren't, were there. As it's easy, let's just go on to the practice. You may find, of course, the PDF. Let me first explain the exercises. And after that, we are going to do them together in this video. So, in the first exercise, you need to compare and describe the two rooms. It's one and the same room, let's imagine. Just the one is now, the other is last year. Okay? So, you need to write down sentences for these five words. Carpet, TV, table, clock and picture. There is now, but there wasn't last year. Something like that. In the second exercise, I need you to write down the correct form of there was or there were. The exercises are really easy. Pause the video, do them, and we are starting the checking right now. Okay, in the first exercise, we need to compare the two pictures. So, there isn't a carpet now. There was a carpet last year. There is a TV now, but there wasn't a TV last year. Of course, your sentences may be a little bit different. If you are not sure if this that you wrote is correct, just please paste it in the Q&A section and I will take a look. There isn't a table now, but there was a table last year. There is a clock now. But there wasn't a clock last year. There isn't a picture now, but there was a picture last year. An extra exercise, choose a room in your flat or in the house where you live and imagine how it was or just remember how it was. Then write down five sentences, now and before. Next exercise. The correct forms. There was, there were. I was hungry, but there wasn't anything to eat. Was everything okay yesterday? I was hungry, but there wasn't anything to eat. Okay, I was hungry, but after but you need the opposite structure of the first one. I was hungry, but there wasn't anything. Anything goes always with the singular verb. Anything is. So, but there wasn't anything to eat. Was everything okay yesterday? Were there any problems? Problems in plural. So, because of that, you need were there, not was there. Were there any problems? I opened the envelope 
but it was empty. There was nothing in it. Remember that in English, you can't have double negative. There was nothing. Nothing, the word nothing, gives you the negative meaning of the whole sentence. You don't need to say there wasn't. If you say there wasn't, then you need the positive word, which means there wasn't anything in it. Okay? We stayed at a very nice hotel. Really? Was there a swimming pool? Swimming pool? One. Was there? You need the singular form. Did you buy any bananas? No, there weren't any in the shop. Bananas? Plural. No, there weren't. Plural form of there were. I think that everything is clear, or at least I hope so. If you have any questions about past simple or about whatever that we have spoken about so far, please write down your questions in the Q&A section. In the next video, we are continuing with the next tense in English. So, I'm looking forward to seeing you there.